And if you were listening to Newsbeat earlier on this evening, immediately before I came on the air, you'll have heard him talking about uh, gimmicks and the use of gimmicks to sell records and uh, the prom- use of promotional activity of one sort or another. And I do feel that uh, if something had been done about the Neon Hearts popular music, I mean, nothing illegal or even silly like triangular records, but if there'd been a bit more promotion on it, I think it could have been a minor hit because it's one of those things which is very insistent and I find myself uh, humming it tunelessly a great deal as I potter about. The first from the Neon Hearts to night anyway and it's called body language
And that's the first from Neon Hearts, and it's called Body Language, and the band are based in the West Midlands and looking for a new guitarist. I mean, an additional guitarist, not a new one. The band at the moment, Tony Deary, lead guitar and lead vocals, and he wants to be uh, turned loose, as it were, just to concentrate on vocals. Steve Hart on sax, Paul Raven on bass, didn't he turn into Gary Glitter once? And uh, Mark Fuller on drums. Another from Neon Hearts, this is the other great sex prose, is the title of it. I'm not sure what it means. <laughs> Midlands boys from good homes in weirdness shock. That's Neon Hearts, the other great sex pros. That's not another one aimed at the Stranglers, is it? And that's the staircase in brackets mystery. And here's another from Neon Hearts. Say no 
See, this is a band that deserves to be better known, I think, as do Joy Division, as I said earlier. Neon Hearts, and that's uh, Roll-On Deodorant. I think uh, Neon Hearts are a little hung up on personal hygiene. This last from them is called Rings of Confidence. <laughs> Rings of Confidence, the last from Neon Hearts, and if you're listening, band, and a good session from you, and uh, the band, not a fashionable band, but a useful one, and I'm not interested in fashionable bands much anyway, and I always assume that you aren't either. Uh, these are Joy Division, the last from them, and this is Insight. <laughs> 